Okay, uh, King John, we located the obelisk here at Mount Eden Survey Point. So if you can uh, address us, I'll read the, uh, what the plaque says. This obelisk was first erected by Stevenson Percy Smith, Chief Geodetic Surveyor, on the 17th day of August, 1872, as initial station for the triangulation of the Auckland Province. Instituted by Captain Theophilus Healy, Inspector of Surveyors. And it's underscored Prudence Futuri. And the second plaque reads, May this obelisk re erected in, the 19, in 1933 serve as a memorial to the pioneer surveyors who played so worthy a part in the transformation of a wilderness into the smiling land which lies before you for the work continuous great beyond their knowing. So could you set, shed some light on your knowing? I uh, appreciate that King John. Okay, so I'll, I'll pull back some of the history. I put all the of that together from the chiefs uh, over a period of time, uh, since 20 years. And so this uh, obelisk is a British title that uh, has got 1933 date on it when they uh, 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 first put the mortgages uh, before Queen uh, Elizabeth II's uh, uh, coronation on, uh, uh, in 1952 in lead up to uh, 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 the, at that time, uh, uh, rearranging the land information titles to coincide with British titles talking about where they, where they came in the harbour here in the harbour. So these, uh, these obelisk is actually uh, the province, they called in those days, the province uh, of Auckland, which right down against them, um, 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 east coast where I come from, as being the same as me being down there as the Manukau being here. They linked up the, the, the Wanoa name of the Hapu there with the Manukau name as their title on their document. They're quite different than the Apu title in the north. They don't have this there. They only have 1840 of list to the Queen. That's their contract in their own time with, uh, with uh, the government of New South Wales, Australia. But this is a big uh, land survey. They call them, they call them uh, uh, pioneers. But, do you, uh, pioneers. Uh, but so can, yeah. can you get into more specifics why they're saying triangulation of the Auckland province? Well, if the, the mark out uh, specific area of points from here to the Kafaru chief that I put the plaque afterwards to his land at, at the Manukau uh, uh, tribal uh, uh, pa site, their, their uh, pa settlement. That's where the Manukau settled long before anybody else settled here. So the British is reading into their history as being more believable to their documents, otherwise they would have put somebody else's names on it. So they joined us at the East Coast as one title, right through, uh, right through there, right through uh, um, uh, to um, Waikato, and up this way, up to at least Tangaparoa, halfway up north. And all that area was the greater Auckland province of a British title, not Australia didn't call it province, only British. And the pioneers who came here and put these things up, not that often. They had no authority to do this on native land. Only them and us. So I'm sitting here beside our tribe. We walk back. And up there's the gravesite where they dug them out and put their white teeth. Uh, so that's, that, that means the, uh, their memorials are connected to our memorials to the survey mortgage layer title uh, 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 mark okay? that, 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 that matches their documents of mm -hmm. title uh, uh, to us. That's why I've got that history document online uh, to, to go back to this particular date, 1933, where the uh, banks started to take off with these titles of, off these marks. Okay? You can only go on these marks originally as being uh, 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 to Westminster. Uh, uh, authority. Authority of the king. Okay? Sorry, the king of England. And so that should be uh, is our uh, title mark that uh, we can, the king can talk to. Okay, not the queen, the king can talk to these marks. Okay, 
So that's Westminster, straight to us. But different and not tall. This way. Ever. Until now. Okay? So that's all I want to say. And all the other writings on this is still pointing to legal, legal or legalese uh, uh, connection by financial issues. Banks is this. The right to use our land to make their business. This is that the business part. Okay? That's what they have survey marks on, survey plays on what we start with. Right? And, and, we're, and we're at Mount Eden, one of the highest points in our it is Mount the Mount highest yeah. point. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And then we'll be going to One Tree yeah. Hill, yeah. which is the second highest point. Yeah. Yeah. And and, and John will give you insight into the, the meaning of that location and the obelisk that is uh, there located. So it's part of that triangulation as well. So, yeah, yeah. That's, that's another survey. Uh, but these are the, the legal part of our land part to the native part. And this, my friends, is the part. I am talking to Cook on basis is the legal title on the document that anyone can so wish to challenge. And you've got the documentation to yes. legally challenge it, the yes. layer of fraudulent titles. Yes. So yeah. King William will be clapping his hands right now and saying, all right, at last, someone has spoke for me. And that's all we're doing here, right? Eh? Is acknowledging King William and his Christmas about to make things real. So that's, uh, you know, the, the other writings on it will, will uh, hinge around our documents. Okay? So, what's more, the province of, of Auckland is stretches from number four, north of here, right down to the east coast, Gidlin, so forth, and the Waikato as this one of the marks. So all through that area, those marks that pin it as the Auckland Super City boundary area inside that big place, inside the part of the New Zealand. Those are going to follow Cook Street. The East title will follow Cook Street land title when we're going to sort it out. So I make myself clear. On behalf of the chiefs who've gone by, we've been standing up here uh, and going through the rituals of chiefs and their parasites. This is where they camp site to watch over their land. Here, there, and up there at the harbour where the British go. They came in there as being their entry point into this country. Like I was saying, the real estate company, the Manukau uh, land company from Glasgow, on behalf of the British, are the ones who put the titles together. When they go, England's in trouble because it hasn't got copyright. Scotland's got So Scotland's got that. Because it's got they are the brains behind them. not the English. The English are the brains in the court, but not the Germans. That's an invention of the Scottish. Okay? So, so we have that connection from here to Britain in legal hours of title that overrides everybody in status and authority. Highest of them. In the world. Okay? I make myself yeah? Yes, King John. Yes. Yes. Now this you're revealing a lot yes. of, of information and kind of distinguishing uh, the Moai uh, with, with the King William the Fourth title and the Maori with the King Victoria title in yes. So, yes, we've got the female line, the male line is this. The memorial of a king. The Maui statue is a uh, 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 stone memorial to a time date. To a time date, to the documents, time date, right here in 1903, to today's uh, 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 means of financial instruments. Okay. So we didn't get uh, anywhere without the king's authority. Borrowing money from the bank. Those survey marks give them time. 
and we have that document to link us to this document. And for clarification purposes, is this under Admiralty law? Yes, clearly, yes. Can you define a little bit more the connection of the Admiralty law with the mortgage? Okay, the, the, the Admiralty law allows a ship to ship its cargo and manifest off one shore to another by King's authority of his protection from the British military through Westminster. And they set that up uh, 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 to trade with the Maoris in the old days with gold and gum and trees and uh, food uh, to uh, 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 Australia, India, America. The same time. So we had trade going on way before the Treaty with the 1835. Already contracted to these that they came later into these to strengthen uh, and to trade in the modern world. Modern world? Now uh, uh, we still go by the dates of, uh, of uh, uh, timeline to, to match up with the Queen, like I was saying. 1952 when she became the Queen, 1933 when the mortgage started, when the racket started in her time. That go haywire from then, more so with what we are trying to uh, show you. We will eventually show you what happened and why we go to Egypt. We are going there for a reason. And my people here at Napoli say, and in the Napoli tribe say, When are you going? Uh, you haven't gone yet. Why are you still here? And I said, Well, we've got to find the people that can get us over there. And so we need a good hand to get the people to go and get the message. John, and on this point, could you please turn around and point where we're, the location where we're headed next, we're right to, behind you? We're going to uh, from one of our uh, mountains to uh, one of the KK, one of the KK, and I want to help you. There used to be one tree there, with a graveside on the top, with a fence, steel fence around it, with this coffin tree. And what the, uh, the new fellows that came in the harbour area, Britain, what they did was they dug the poor chiefs out under Mohi Manikau's nose and when he was 38. He was a, he's one of the three, three nations. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about yeah. that when we get so there. Anyway, he, they dug his and put, put John Lowe in Campbell. You'll find that the Campbells are up north, are here, are on the east coast, and I'm going to tell you this uh, John Cameron's real servant is a Campbell. Check it. Check it. Jo John. Cameron's yes, real is. name is a Campbell? Yes. Oh, that's what fits to King William. He, he's saying he's a descendant, but a descendant of King William IV. So they have linked themselves to our title. So I'm going there to unlink the class. It's not his contract. We're in a private contract. We can't come as third party. No, no, no. 
That's what happened to the third party. Police stacked it to stop me from dealing with the owner, fortunate business, on that land to the to the server. Okay? All right. Give him, give him, give him the yes, it's, uh, as I said, it's a chess game, Da Vinci Code, and <laughs> where in the world is Waldo, I guess, <laughs> combination. So, no, this is very insightful. Uh, and it will inform a lot of people so they have a better understanding and their role uh, as part of the common share it that everyone does, is entitled to. It does affect everyone in the world, especially the Commonwealth, America, and uh, uh, anybody that's using the Queen as a head of state. It affects, this affects them. What we do with Cook Street affects all land titles in the world, from Britain to Western. That's why she's ran away from Western because she knows she's going to get caught when I get there, okay? When I get there, I'm going to ask her some questions with the press and say, <clears throat> we just come here to uh, check the trust, change the head of the trust, and I shall go as the head of the trust, the Queen Victoria Trust, then open the books and check the balance where and what, and who is going to, all the people who support us in the world. We're the flag. And we'll be following you on that uh, when you're journeying to London as well. So thank you for thank you. letting us know uh, what your plans when you arrive in London. We'll continue this story uh, and unravel <laughs> the layers and layers of uh, hidden information. So thank you, King John. We're off to One Tree Hill. Uh, we'll see. No you Tree Hill. No Hill. No Tree. No tree. It's no, no longer. Tree. It was a one tree, but it's now it's a no tree. No but tree. the actual uh, native name for that hill is Manga KK. Manga KK. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.